In this video, I'm going to give you some tips to protect your blaster from unnecessary wear or damage, beginning with the startup and shutdown procedures, the latter of which it's very important to do in the correct order. Let's start with the proper way to pressurize your machine. Assuming your compressor is idled up and ready for work, open the compressor service valve slowly. Next, close the blowdown valve on the blast pot. It's also good to double check that the overflow and water inlet are closed. Now you can slowly open the air inlet to pressurize. When pressurizing your blast machine, you want to make sure you do it slowly. Instantly dumping a huge surge of pressure into the system isn't good for gaskets or hoses or gauges or regulators or anything else. Do it gently. When shutting down your machine, it's extremely important to do it in the correct order. If you were to just turn off the compressor without following these steps, all the pressure inside the blast pot could actually backflow into other parts of the system, causing damage. For example, water and abrasive could actually damage the control box if it backflowed past the filter regulator that's meant to protect it. It could also backflow into the actual compressor and cause damage there. Of course, there are check valves to prevent this, but do you really want to trust a $50 check valve to protect a $20,000 compressor? Not me. This filter regulator's job is to limit the incoming air pressure and to filter out any debris before it can get into the control box. The filtered moisture and debris will collect at the bottom of this bowl, where it can be vented through this screw. Make sure to keep this screw cracked open to let moisture out continuously. And while you're at it, make sure you do the same thing to your moisture trap. Every now and then, these may clog with debris, and you can simply open them up all the way for a second to clear the clogs. If your filter regulator has a lot of debris in it, there's a video in the Academy that shows how to clean it out. In summary, pressurize the blast pot slowly. Depressurize the blast pot before turning off the compressor and keep the system purged of water. For more tips and tricks, check out our academy and have a great day.